www.thepeacefulcry.com. As a field engineer, we um, are the first point of contact for a lot of the uh, developers and other people that want to build within our city. And what we do is we put together the construction packages for the crew. So we uh, take the requests in from either developers or our long-term planning department and we put together the drawing packages, the material lists, um, so we can reserve the material at the warehouse and get all of our documentation together, the contracts, um, for anybody that wants any gas or electric extensions. I'm in the gas planning and design department and uh, essentially my group looks at every sort of gas uh, design that goes into the ground except for some of the emergency stuff. Um, but all the new construction, all renewals, everything that, that goes into the ground that's related to gas, my group is reviewing and designing, um, making sure that it's going to operate safely and according to compliance um, and also just making sure that it will satisfied the demands of our system and our customers. I specialize in electric distribution and conceptual design of the system as we need to extend it over the next few years. The electric distribution system is really the poles and wires that you see or the green boxes that you see out in the neighborhood and electrically that begins at the substation. We spend about 85% of our time in the office, 80-85%. The rest is at substation sites or factory testing or design reviews. The most challenging part or technical aspect of this position is the the lot of responsibility that we have for our system where we have to work very closely with our other groups to design our transformer specs, our switch gear specs. These are equipment that cost five, six, eight thousand dollars and they're very, very critical for our system. If they're not done well, our system could be affected very significantly. Some of the tools we use to put together our projects, we use uh, AutoCAD, we use a specific suite that's called AutoCAD Utilities Design that was made for doing uh, electrical designs. We also use IBM Maximo to do our estimating and reserve material in the warehouse and then we use mostly just uh, spreadsheets and other kind of engineering tools. We, we don't get pigeonholed into one little thing, we get to, even, even across a day, we get to see four or five different things maybe. Um, we're, we're not so specialized that we don't have variety. One of the things that I like most about the position that I have is that we do most of the engineering in-house. We rarely go out. Um, I just recently learned how to do ground grid analysis and design and we, we do it ourselves and that really impacts the way our, our system is going to be protective. I also love the fact that I get to provide a service to the community as well, and that's, that's what a lot of people feel about working at Colorado Springs Utilities. Um, that on those cold winter days, people are going to have gas to heat their homes and they're going to be able to go on and carry, carry on their business as normal. Um, and there's a lot of things that happen behind the scenes to ensure that that takes place without people noticing it. We take a great deal of pride in stewardship in this company. We are designing things, building things that are expected to last and part of keeping things lasting is taking care of them, looking out for them. Infrastructure, um, even ideas we need to nurture and keep track of and, and take care of and this is what allows us to pass something along to the next people who come along that they can live with. <laughs>